If you are using ChatGPT, please watch this so you do not make this huge mistake. There's actually two big mistakes that you can make. First of all, do not put any confidential information into ChatGPT or AI because that's not good. We'll just say that. That means they can use the information that you input. They can use that information for other people's requests. So when I'm using ChatGPT, I never even use my company name. I, I don't use anything. I use templates. And then I go back in and I change it. I customize it. Now, another huge mistake is do not take what ChatGPT gives you and send that off without changing anything about it. You're going to put a prompt into ChatGPT. It's going to come back with something that, yeah, it sounds good but you need to go in and actually customize it, add maybe your tone to it, move a couple things around to see how it sounds. A lot of times people can tell if you are using ChatGPT because it sounds very robotic. So you need to humanize what is being said. And that's the easy part. The hard part is coming up with the entire thing that ChatGPT comes up with. All you have to do is go in and customize it so that it doesn't sound like a robot. I have a bunch of ChatGPT prompts in my template library if you wanna grab that, plus a bunch of other templates that I use as an executive assistant.